What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the Kentucky Dynasty here in NCAA 2004. We lost to Hawaii. We lost to Louisville. Do we have a chance versus number 21, Indiana? Possibly. It is a rivalry game, so they're going to be up for it. But maybe they're looking ahead to their next week opponent, which is number one, Oklahoma. You never know. Crazier things have happened, all right? So they are a top 25 team. We have not beaten the top 25 team. Heck, we've only won one game so far this dynasty. It has been rough, but we're not going nowhere. Anyways, we have made a change at quarterback, okay? We're going with number 11 over number 7. He has slightly better throw power, slightly better throw accuracy, and in this game, we are all about to spread, throw it out, air it out, whatever you want to call it type of offense we do run the draw play because that's the only one play that works in this darn game okay i love this game and i hate this game all at the same time can we get the upset we are ranked number one 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 111 taking on number 21 is this the day that we get the upset that we beat a rival that we beat a team that actually like kind of matters sorry ohio but like you know what i mean did we beat ohio i think we beat ohio anyways man we get a hit on the quarterback there it's second down in 10 they're gonna roll right Throw it, and it's intercepted by the best defender on the squad, our strong safety. We're going to run the ball up that gut on the draw play. That's going to work out for a gain of three. Let's see what number 11 can do. He's going to roll right, set his feet, throws a strike to Lopez, who hauls it in and went inside the 30. Draw play again, breaking ankles and breaking hearts as he work away upfield for a gain of four. So second down, six yards to go. We're going to pass it again, and that pass, is, okay, not a good one. But we're going to come right back. We're going to look downfield. We're still looking. We're going to throw it, and that pass is caught and will be a first down with two for three so far today. Looking downfield, we're going to roll left, and then we're going to throw it to the end zone, and it's caught. Touchdown, Wildcats. Kentucky has the lead. Can our defense keep it that way is now the question. Offset eye look. The fullback to the left side, tied into the right side. They run it to the tight end side. And there goes number one making a play in the ground game. They're going to run the ball again, and our linebacker coming through when we need him to. And he's all kinds of fired up. So they're going to run the ball here on third down. The spin move, and they're able to work their way upfield for a first down. So the chains are moving. Our strong safety with a stop there. Our free safety, true freshman four-star recruit with a stop there. Now they throw the ball over the middle. Decent gain. Third down and around five. They throw it. That pass is caught by the fullback. Gets forced out of bounds, and he's shaking up. So that's not a good look, but it is what it is. It's, it's, you know, it's a physical game. Sometimes things happen. Direct snap to the running back, and the running back going to go nowhere fast. Well, he does pick up four, so that is somewhere. They run the ball with number 34. He's going to pick up a gain of around three. So third down, they run the ball again, and they find success again. This does not look nice because this has been a long drive, and they continue to just push through the resistance. They run the ball. And they pick up another solid game. So third down and four. End the round. And we chop him down. They're going to go for it on fourth and two from inside the red zone. Toss play. And they pick it up by the hairs of their chinny chin chin. They run the ball again. This time to the left side. And we get a stop. And now they're looking at second down to go. They're going to go to the air. We hit the quarterback. But it's a touchdown nonetheless. And that is going to do it for the first half. First quarter, excuse me, of play. So 7-7 seven, seven is the score, first down and 10. Looking downfield, that pass will be caught. And, I, you know, I think this quarterback might have a little something, something. Going to go up that guy. That play is going to result in a first down. Going to spread things out. Five receivers, if you kind of tied in out there, with Crosley and Lopez makes the catch. And he's going to work his way past the 50-yard line in the first down for the Wildcats. We're going to run a draw play. Our run game has not looked this good ever. We're looking pretty good right here, right now. Going to run the ball again. And now it's second down to one, but yo, I'm not going to buy too much into that. We're going to throw it because that's how we get the ball downfield, by throwing that thing. We're going to throw it there for a first down. Looking downfield again. We're going to roll left. We're going to wait. We're going to throw it into a crowd, but it's caught nonetheless. We are heating up with percolating. Can we score inside the red zone? We're going to weave through traffic. That might be the biggest gain of the dynasty on the ground. We go up the gut. We can't get any yard again to the end zone. Second down to go. Crossley is wide open. Touchdown. And the big tight end has given us the lead yet again. So defense, I need y'all to just like like stop this team, please. End the round, and there you go, defense. That's what I need to see from you. Second down and ten. They go up the guy. 
and they get shut down. So it's going to be third down around five. They're going to run a triple option. They pitch it. They got a block downfield, and he's loose into the secondary. Nice run play right there on the triple option, and they're up past the 40-yard line. They're going to run the ball again. They pitch it, and we can't recover a fumble. Second down and one. Looking downfield, that pass is caught, and it's going to be a first down as they work their way inside the 25. They're going to fire that thing. That pass is caught. Fumble! We can't recover fumbles. What is going on? Second down and five. They throw it back across the way, and that pass will fall incomplete. Third down and five. Defense, I'm begging for a stop right here. Indiana, they're like, no stop for you. Touchdown pass number two and touchdown reception number two. It's a deadly combination, number 10 to number 80. We're going to roll left, roll right. You know I'm dyslexic. Don't judge me. We roll right, first down, catch right there. We step up. We throw it to Crosby. That's going to be a first down as well. First down in 10, 42 seconds on the clock. Over the middle, Lopez. He's coming through when we need him to move those chains. That's 10 straight completions for our quarterback. He completed his first one. His second one was incomplete from that moment in time. It's been 11 in a row now. Second down and one. Looking downfield. We're going to throw it. That pass is caught. 12 in a row. We get up to the 30-yard line now in the Indiana Territory. We're going to roll right. Still rolling. We're going to set our feet. Heave it deep, and it's caught. Touchdown, Wildcats. Do you believe the miracles? We roll right. Nothing happening. We wait. We wait. We see a glimmer of blue in the end zone, and we see our man, and we put that thing on a frozen rope. And we are up 21-14 to over number 21, Indiana. So we get up out the end zone. We're going to weave through traffic just a tad bit, just a little bit, and we get stopped just shy of the 20. We run the ball. We're still shy of the 20. We lose a yard there. Looking downfield. That pass is caught. This quarterback, I feel like he can't miss as of right now. That pass leads to a first down. That run leads to a gain of three. Second down, seven yards to go. That pass also caught. And now it's third down and short. Can we keep the drive alive? We just need three yards. We're going to drop it off to number four. He's going to pick up the first down by the skin of his teeth. Move those chains. That's all we needed. We're going to go up the gut. That play gets us two. Second down. We throw it. That's our first incompletion, like almost 15 tries. Third down and eight now. Can we get back on the completion train? Yes, we can. That pass is caught up the seam, and it's a Kentucky first down. We throw it to Lopez a little bit behind him. Got to set our feet. Going to look downfield again. Going to throw it deep to Lopez. It's tempted and caught. Sometimes the ball will bounce your way, and it did that time. Looking downfield is Lopez. <laughs> Excuse me. Lopez was open, but we throw it to number four, and our quarterback puts it on the money. So we are now up by two touchdowns. Fumble! We can't recover fumbles. And I don't know why we can't. We just can't recover the darn ball. Looking downfield. That pass, caught. That's going to be a gain of around seven. Make it six. So second down and four. They throw it backwards, and that's going to be a loss on the play. So let's go defense. Third down and eight. Can we get a stop here? That pass, caught. No stop for the Kentucky defense yet again. So we're still on the field. They still got the football. Then give me that Yahoo. They hurt. I said, give me that Yahoo. Give me that user interception. And we got this thing going back the other way. We're going to run the ball. And we're going to go nowhere fast. That's all right. Second down and nine. From the pocket. We fire it. And it's dropped. It was on the money. It was slightly behind them. But it was a... It was a catchable it was a catchable ball. Catchable pass. We throw it to Lopez. He has it. Then the hit knocks that one loose. So back-to-back -back drops, and Indiana takes back over. They run the ball with their quarterback. We punish him as we should. They run the ball, and we're punishing their running back as well. So now it's going to be third down and seven. Can we get another stop? They throw it. That pass is incomplete. We force the three and out. Do you believe we're going to run the ball? We get chopped down, but that's a good game. Gain of seven. Second down and three. We get chopped down at the line of scrimmage. And that's going to take us to the fourth quarter of play. We're up by two touchdowns. But Indiana is ready for this. Hopefully we are too. So third down and four. Can we convert here? We have our man open, but we throw the ball behind him. He was running a comeback route to the inside of the defender. So on the punt, Indiana's going to jump off sides. 
It looked like encroachment, but this game's like 20 years old, okay? So not everything's perfect, okay? Not everything gonna be perfect, but it's a fun game to play. Anyways, offsides on them, that's a first down because it was fourth and four. So first down and 10, we take back over. Up that gut, trying to take away some of the clock, but we gotta move the ball as well. Gonna run the ball again. We're not moving too much on those two plays, and now number 30 is eight. Is, is eight, number 30 is hurt. What is wrong with my mouth? Now we're gonna drop back, and we get sacked. So we get the ball right back to Indiana via the three and out. They run the ball. We shut that down. Second down and nine now. They throw it. It's caught and then dropped and then caught and then dropped again. So he can't believe it, but I can. Third down and nine. It's our time, right? Defense get off the field one more time, and we do. Will they go for it? No. 340 on the clock. They're down by two touchdowns. We run the ball, and we're going to pick up five yards. We run the ball again, and we're going to... Pick up around three yards, so third down and two. Should we run it? Maybe, but we're gonna go to the air. Crossley is open. He has short hands, except for when it matters the most. 2.30 on the clock. Indiana takes back over. That pass is caught, and the young tight end is rumbling and bumbling up to the, about the 50 yard line. They're gonna fire it. They're in the Kentucky territory just like that. Looking downfield. That pass caught, and they're inside the 20. Second down, first down, excuse me, tipped and then caught. So on first and goal, they get into the end zone. So they're going to be down by one touchdown, and we can't recover the ball even when we fumble. That's ridiculous. I thought they might go for the onside kick, so I caught it. So our man had to run back there, try to retrieve the football, couldn't do it. We do get up to about the 20 yard line, close to it. Second down, nine yards to go. Looking downfield, we're still looking, still looking to throw it deep. R1 was open, 83, couldn't make a play on the football before it got batted away. Can we complete a pass here? Third down and nine, we step up and we overthrow our man by Billy Eyelash. What is going on? We can't complete a pass. We complete like 15 in a row, and now we're like 20 of 28. It hasn't been good. That pass is caught. He put that one on the frozen rope. Minute 02 on the clock. First down and 10. Number 10 throws it. That pass is caught. They get brought down just shy of the first down. 55 seconds on the clock as Indiana burns a timeout. That pass no good. Mm -mm, not going to work out for you. Third down and three. Looking. Firing. That pass is caught. Can we make the play? We do, but not until they cross the first down marker by the tip of the football, just the nose of the football. That pass is caught and that's gonna be a touchdown. This game is all tied up. Do we play for overtime? No, we're gonna try to win the game here. Looking downfield, Lopez, open, makes the catch, crosses the 30 and gets out of bounds. That's a perfect play to start the drive. Looking downfield here, that pass is caught. We're gonna have to burn a timeout. So 23 seconds on the clock, first down and 10. Looking downfield, that pass is caught. We're we are disconnected on all cylinders here. We're firing. Everything is working beautifully. First down and 10. We're going to roll right. We're going to look for Lopez. And he was open, but we overthrow him. 13 seconds on the clock. Second down and 10. We're going to throw it as we set our feet. And we got a hit. And it's picked. And there's not a fast guy on the field for Kentucky except for Lopez. But he's down the field. And that's going to be a touchdown to end the ball game. There is no time on the clock and there are no flags on the field. Indiana got a miracle. Can you believe this? Can you believe? Can you believe this? Are you seeing this? Do you know what just happened? Do you comprehend this? I don't. I'm like, yo, this is like three minutes on the clock. We're going to mess around. Not only win, but win versus a top 25 team, a team that's our rival. And it didn't happen. It didn't happen. But number 11, I think, is that guy. Uh, at one point... He only had one incompletion, and he was like, I want to say 16 or 17. And that was like in the first half, I believe. So the second half, things have started to go left in our passing game. We couldn't really run the ball consistently. We're, all, we're, we're able to get three to four yards, sometimes seven, but for the most part, we can't rely on our running game to really move the chains like that. And our defense broke down and wore down late in the ball game. But I do think that we're taking steps in the right direction. EA Sports, Madden. IGN. Anyways, that's going to do it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope that I say he's the best today. And until you meet again, my friends, <clears throat> peace, love. Hi, sauce.